Hey everybody, it's Drum Jr. and in this week's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to install the new replacement to Exodus, known as Covenant, on your current version of Kodi, which is 17.3. Now you might be wondering, what happened to Exodus? Well, the developers decided to drop the whole project like completely and create a new um, add-on named Covenant. Basically, it is exactly the same as Exodus, just a different name and artwork. If you want to download it, once I show you how to download it, and you get into there, you're going to feel just right at home. Nothing changed. So, let me waste no time and jump into it. I'm The device I'm going to be using is the Fire Stick. If you have your laptops or whatever, but you're running Kodi, you can use this method in this video to help you get to your go and continue watching you know what you're watching i'm not even gonna say it so let's jump right into it guys now when you first open up cody what you're gonna want to do is scroll up to where the gear is at which is settings click that once you click that scroll down to file manager once you highlight our file manager click that and we're gonna want to add a source Scroll down to add a source if it don't automatically highlight already for you. Click that, and then once you click none, type in the URL exactly how I'm going to type in. Okay, guys? Once you have this URL typed in, what you want to go ahead and do is press OK. Now, if I type that in a little bit too fast, don't worry. You can always go back and pause the video to give yourself a little bit more time. But um, I'm going to go farther. So, once you have hit OK, it's going to take it to the screen. It automatically fills in the name which is magic let's go ahead and leave that that's just fine now hit OK <clears throat> and once you hit OK you're gonna wanna go back until you get to the main screen of Cody and we're gonna wanna go down now to add-ons click add-ons so now once we get to here you wanna go up to the open box and click the box icon when you click the box icon, you want to go down to install from zip file. Click that, and let's look for the source magic. And we're going to click magic. Okay, scroll down, click repository. Click that. And then go down one more and click that. This is actually the zip folder that we're going to install. Once you click it, it's going to take a second, but what it's going to do it's gonna go ahead and install we would know that because we would get a notification in the corner oh like right now let's say Aries project add-on install so once we have that pop up what we're gonna want to do is now scroll up to install from repository okay click that and go down to Aries project click it scroll down to add-on I mean program add-ons click that and Aries wizard and click that now we are actually installing Aries wizard um, click install highlighting and click install give it a second you see I say downloading and look that's done it's in the corner is done now if we go back hit back hit back hit back and we are at that add-on screen again if you accidentally went back too far, it's okay. If you went this far back to your main screen, just click add-ons and get back into that sub-menu, I like to call it. You know it's a sub-menu because off in the left corner at the top, it'll say add-ons. But anyways, once you're here, you want to scroll down to program add-ons. Because that's what Aries Wizard is. Just like Indigo was in the past, or Fusion, you guys like to know. Know it as, also know it as. You want to scroll down, scroll over to Aries Wizard. And we're going to click it. And what it's going to do, because it's the first time opening it, it's going to be extracting 
files and stuff from the folder. So give it a minute. Now once you get to this screen guys, what you're going to want to do is press right until you scroll over to browse add-ons. Click that. What you're going to do is scroll down one to video add-ons. Click that and we're going to be looking for a covenant. So scroll down until you find covenant. Once you find covenant, click it and then it's going to automatically highlight install. We're going to want to click install. Right now it's is extracting from a zip file and it's going to be installing. Aries Wizard does it all for you. So we'll give it a second. It usually happens quick. It always show you this. Don't mind it. It's just something that just I don't know why it pops up. Just click OK. It's going to complete installing covenant there you go that's what I was trying to tell you guys that's how you know when it's done but once you hit OK it's gonna ask you something do you want to install the repository yes we want to because we don't have this repository installed for covenant what a repository is is basically it allows covenant or whatever add-on you have installed to update every day constantly for you to have the newest latest up-to-date software and material inside of the add-on or program so once you get this screen saying Colossus was successfully installed you're basically done you have Covenant installed now you gotta do is scroll up and we're gonna wanna highlight close click that and we're gonna wanna close this down we're gonna hit um, no because we don't want to launch another website. Now go all the way back. You either go back to your add-on screen and it's going to be under video add-on or you just go back to your main screen and when you scroll down to add-ons Covenant it's going to be right here. Now one thing to note guys is when you first install Covenant and you launch it um, you're going to get blanks. Okay don't panic what you need to do is you need to go up go back and go up to the power logo and we're gonna exit Cody we gotta relaunch Cody guys so I'm gonna show you guys I'm exiting Cody I just closed it off so now let me relaunch it and Covenant is gonna work with no issue so let Cody load up again we're gonna scroll down to add-ons Covenant and there you go. See how everything now have a title. It's no more blinks. So um, if you like this content, guys, go ahead and hit a thumbs up and subscribe. If you don't know who I am, I do Amazon Fire TV Stick videos, Joe Breaks. I'll show you the newest and latest, keep you up to date. Until the next time, guys, it was a pleasure. See you on the next video.